Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Um, let me take this hair elastic off my wrist. Um, but anyways, I'm just going to be filming a chatty get ready with me. Like I'm going to be just talking about updates and stuff and changes that are going to be made to my channel for the new year. Um, so yeah, if you've noticed, um, I'm not going to be uploading on Saturdays anymore. I'm going to be uploading on Wednesdays just to give it a little bit of a change. I've been uploading on Saturdays for I think the past like year and a half, two years. So I just wanted to switch it up and move it to Wednesdays. Um, and then that gives me like the full weekend to edit the video before it going up. So it just makes it a little bit easier. So yeah, um, let's get into this get ready with me. Obviously, as you can see, I'm barefaced, so I'm gonna get started. So um, I got a new makeup bag from Victoria's Secret. How beautiful is it? Um, so I work at Bath Body Works, so I get a discount at, obviously, Bath Body Works. Uh, Victoria's Secret, Pink, and Henry Bendel, because they're all under the same company. So um, part of the reason why I bought this and why I was like, yeah, I'm gonna get a new makeup bag is because I could use my discount because makeup bags are expensive, but I really needed a new one. And this one has like two pockets, so I can put some of my more like delicate items in here and then like all the rest I just shove in the other side. And then I just use my old Victoria's Secret bag um, for my brushes. Obviously this would be like on my vanity, but this is um, because I'm at my parents' house. It's more like an everyday makeup bag that I'm just gonna carry around. Um, I'm just using the Marcel Multi Defense Lotion. It's oil-free, um, just this moisturizer. I'm just gonna put this on my skin. Um, there is SPF in it. I mean, I don't think I'm gonna get much of a sunburn today. I don't know why I couldn't think of that word, um, but I'm gonna put it on anyways. And I used another lotion earlier, but you can never have too many moisturizers. That's one thing I wanna change in the new year. I'm gonna be talking about this in a future video, like new habits I wanna start like, not implementing, but like adding in, I don't really know, to my uh, everyday life and skincare is one of them. So yeah, I'm gonna like make an order of um, off Sephora of some new skincare products and I really wanna get one of those like face brushes you use like to wash your face. Um, but yeah, not until I get paid because Haley has no money. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna just go in with my Joe Fresh Matte Sheer Tint um, foundation. It's kind of like a foundation. I feel like it's more like a BB cream. Actually, before I even get started, I am gonna prime my face. I totally forgot to do that. Um, I'm just using the Milk Makeup Blur Stick. I got this for Christmas and I really like it. I love how it's in stick form. Um, I don't know, it just makes it like really easy. Anyways, this is what it looks like. It kind of smells good. I don't even know how to like describe the smell. Actually, it kind of reminds me, I don't know if it's just because I got this for Christmas. It reminds me of Terry's orange chocolate. I don't know. But anyways, I really like the smell. It just reminds me of Christmas time. So yeah, I'm just gonna blend that all in. Um, so yeah, this is gonna be more of like an update video and like things I'm gonna be changing and just like chatty, just talking about things that are going on. I had filmed a video and I was originally going to upload it on Saturday because I wasn't going to change my uploading schedule. Like I only just kind of decided this not too long ago. Um, but I'm going to make some changes. Like I'm going to change my intro a little bit. Not too much, but like just make like minor changes and then um, change my header, my profile picture, just random things like that. Just to give it like a new feel for the new year. Um, nothing crazy, obviously. So yeah, I'm just going to go in with my sponge, this one. It's just from the drugstore. I can't remember what brand it was. I honestly just bought the set because it was black and I really wanted a black beauty blender um, and not pay $26. So yeah, I'm just gonna blend this out. This foundation blends out really weird. I don't know if it's like the sponge I used, but I find it takes longer to blend out than like other foundations I've used. So I'm gonna try and speed this part up so that this video isn't a million years long because it's supposed to be just like a really quick update video. And I really wanted to, um, film a makeup video. I had planned on filming um, like a holiday or festive um, get ready with me and I filmed it and I really didn't like what the lighting looked like in the video. I just like wasn't happy with it and I was about to edit it and then I was just like you know what I'm not I don't want to just put something up on my channel um, that I don't like just to get something up. Um, I'm more in the mindset of like quality over quantity obviously and I never understood why the YouTubers I watch said that because I was like, I'd watch anything that they put up. But I wanna make sure that like the videos I am uploading are things I'm proud of and not things that I'm putting up just to get them up to follow my schedule, if that makes sense. But yeah, I'm gonna be uploading a lot more in the new year. I'm really sorry for being so inconsistent. But like between work and school, it's been crazy. Okay, then for concealer, I'm just going with the Tarte Rainforest of the C Aqua Concealer. Um, mine is in the shade Fair. If you were wondering, I'm in the shade, what is this? 
porcelain in the Joe Fresh one. I think it's either the lightest or the second lightest shade. I'm not sure. Anyways, I'm running low on this one. I'm going to need to buy more because I like it. Sorry, I'm using the viewfinder. I don't want to bring up my mirror for this. Um, I really like it. You get a lot, and I love the applicator. I mean, it's the same as the uh, uh, Tarte Shape Tape, I think. I mean, obviously, they're both by Tarte, so the applicators are probably going to be similar. But I really like how it's like doe foot um, as opposed to just like your normal brush. I don't know. Also, I'm breaking out of it, so I gotta put like extra on my chin. I'm not even stressed. I don't know why I'm breaking out. I have like no reason to break out right now. Um, but yeah, I'm just gonna blend that in. I think I'm gonna buy a second one actually. I really like it. I rarely buy the same product twice when it comes to like high end products, only because they're pricey and I wanna try out a couple different ones, but I really do like it. Um, I am more oily skin, but I don't find this makes me any oiler, oil, oilier than, um, than normal. And it's really light, like it doesn't cake up and stuff. I think it's because it's like more water based. But I really like it and I love the, um, the finish of it. And I like the product, like how it comes, like again, like the doe foot applicator. I would say it's more like light to medium coverage. It's nothing like crazy, but I mean, I like it because I wear foundation and concealer every day. So I don't want to look like super cakey. Especially if I'm just going to class or something. Alright, um, I'm just going to spritz my face quickly and then like blend it in again. I don't know, I feel like my makeup's just looking kind of weird right now. This is a matte finish setting spray by NYX. I'm just going to let that like soak into my skin as like an added barrier. Um, and then I'm going to set my face with the Marcel face powder. This is awesome, you get so much. It's like 70 grams, I think. Yeah, 70 grams, and it was 15 bucks, um, which is like really freaking good for drugstore, especially because Marcel, it's kind of like, it's not like the expensive drugstore brand, but it's like a little bit more expensive. Luca, my cat's being crazy. Anyways, I'm just gonna set that with my, um, what is this, my sponge? I'm just doing like chatty get ready for me. I haven't done one in a really long time. I normally just film it and then I just do like, um, what is it, like a time lapse with like music, which I really enjoy. I like editing those kind of videos. I mean, there's not much to them, but I just, I like them. Um, oh, my friend Ravi got me um, a bunch of new brushes from BH Cosmetics. They're vegan and cruelty free, and I'm super pumped to use them. But um, yeah, I don't know what this is. What is it? Oh, it's the BH Cosmetics Brush 31. I don't know if I'm saying that right, but yeah. I'm just gonna grab a little bit more of my brush just to help blend it out. I don't bake for too long because I don't, again, want to look really cakey, but I put it there just to make sure that I have like a lot of product on my face because I get so oily. It's so annoying. Okay, that should be fine. That was a lot. I'm going to use the same brush again, or actually, no, I'm going to use this one. This one's by Jessup. I have no idea. I got it off eBay a long time ago. They're new, obviously, but they're just really affordable. I love this one. It's dense enough, and I love the angle of it to do my uh, contour. Why am I so out of breath? Oh my god, and my necklaces keep going. Oh no, they're there. Oh yeah, I didn't show you guys. Whoops. Um, I didn't show you guys. Um, well, I'll show you both my necklaces. There we go. I have this one. Um, it's just the Miss May. It's just because my birthday's in May. It's from the Playboy, whatever, I don't really know. But it's cute. Um, I saw one of the other YouTubers I watch wear it, so I wanted to buy myself one. And then Bailey actually got me a necklace. This one is, I don't know, I think it's gold. I don't really 100% know. But it says my name on it and I love it. And I'm just pairing them together today. I normally don't, but I felt like being extra and wearing two different necklaces because I want to be that person that like wears lots of necklaces all the time. So I don't want to take them off because then I just forget to put them back on. Also, I'm using the chocolate Soleil bronzer. Also, I want to hear about your guys' Christmas. Mine was really good. I mean, if you care. Um, mine was really nice. Um, I have two weeks off of school, so this is my last week. I'm currently filming this on the Tuesday, and then I go back on Monday. Um, I really enjoyed having the time off. I was so, st not stressed in December, but like, I felt like I just had a lot going on, so I didn't really have a lot of time to do anything. Um, so this is like my chill week. Last week I was working a bit, but this week I'm not at all, so I'm gonna take advantage of not having to work because yeah, December was just a lot, but it's because I started in the holidays at a retail retail position, which I'm totally happy about. I really, really love working Bath Money Works. 
um, and they actually asked me to keep working as like a regular sales associate for the rest of the year and I'm really really excited because this obviously was just a seasonal position and I wasn't going to be working there like permanently but since they asked me now I'm going to be and I'm really excited. Everybody there is so nice and I actually really like the job obviously I mean why would you <laughs> apply to a job that you don't like but it was mainly like I just needed extra money for Christmas and I knew a lot about Bath and Body Works I just really like their products and stuff so I wanted to work somewhere where like I knew a lot about what they were selling so that when people ask me about it like I can actually give them like my personal opinions and stuff um anyway so I've learned a lot being there and like tips and tricks to use for selling um not like in bad ways or anything just like words you should be using and like how you approach people kind of thing um, so yeah, I really really like it and I'm excited to work there for the rest of the year um, And for however long they need me It's gonna be a lot less hours, which is totally fine because December was a little crazy um, And they just yeah, they're just not as busy obviously, so that's totally cool I'm just really excited to continuing or to be to continue working there. I can't speak just yeah Everybody's really nice. I like the job and I like I just really like it. Anyways, I'm going to stop rambling. I think I'm going to go for some highlight today. I normally don't, but I think I'm going to. I'm just going to use the Tarte Highlighter in Exposed. Anyways, this is a huge fan brush. This is the number 36 again from BH Cosmetics. I don't even know. I don't think this is a highlighter brush. I think it's supposed to be like for your contour, but I'm going to use it anyways. And I never use highlight, but I feel like it today. Can't forget your nose. This looks so weird. <laughs> this feels weird. But I like it. Okay. I think that's enough. Okay, I think I'm gonna move on to eyebrows. This video is probably gonna be so long, so I'm gonna zip right through it. But I'm using the Tarte Waterproof Brow Mousse to see Amazonian Clay. This is in taupe. It's a little bit lighter than what I'm used to using, but because it's a pomade, I didn't want to go too dark. So yeah, I'm gonna fill them in, um, and then I'll talk to you guys in a second. by Petra Lash Line Ink and this one um, it doesn't oh it's in black silk okay again I'm gonna fast forward this because this takes me a while <laughs> whoops I <laughs> just lost the cap yeah this takes me a while so I'm gonna zoom through this really quick Lights Camera Lashes by Tarte. It's just the mini one I had gotten um, in like a little set. Also, I've been watching um, the new season of Gilmore Girls. It's the one that came out last year. I'm only just watching it now. Um, I wanted to get through the whole series of Gilmore Girls before I started. So I finished the series last night. It was so good. I really love it. Um, I'm a little sad with the ending for Rory. I'm not gonna say like what happened. You guys probably already know what happened, but I'm not gonna like, and I'm not gonna say any spoilers, but I'm happy for Lorelai, but I'm kinda disappointed for Rory. But anyways, um, I don't know how I feel about the new series. Like most of the characters are the same in terms of like their acting hasn't changed, but like Lorelai's a little bit different. My mom had made a comment that her acting is like a tiny bit different. I don't know, it like almost sounds more scripted as opposed to like just coming natural. And she was so good in the original series. Um, maybe just obviously because it's been so long and they haven't like worked together So like still amazing and like the fact that they were able to get that many um, Characters back to do like the reboot. It's pretty impressive But yeah, um, it comes in four episodes and they're all like an hour and a half each So there's the spring not spring it starts with winter and then the next episode is spring and then summer and then the last one is fall So I've watched all the way up to the end of summer I just have fall to watch. I'm probably gonna watch that one after this, like while I'm editing this video. And it's kind of sad. Like it, it like it doesn't have the same like feel good, like emotion behind it that you get when you watch the series. I don't know. Like it's it's not bad by any means, but it's just like not as good as the original. But I feel like it's kind of hard to like top the original. It was such a classic. It was so good. I remember watching it um, when I was a lot younger with my older sister. That was her favorite TV show growing up, and it's still one of her favorites so I had like seen a bunch of episodes just in like random order and I I didn't know the story behind like all the characters because I just came in and out of the episodes 
Um, but yeah, I really, really enjoyed watching the series and I can totally see why my sister just like throws it on to watch in the background. It's just a really good feel good, not movie, I was gonna say movie. It's a really good feel good TV show. Um, and you can kind of come in and out of like whichever episode and you'll kind of have an idea of what's going on. But I'm not as impressed with the, uh, with the reboot, but that's okay. It's also kind of sad seeing like the characters older. Like Rory's 32 in it. Like that's crazy. That's not exactly how old Lorelai was I think when this series started, but like it was kind of like that. It's just, it's so weird thinking about it. Anyways, that's it for lashes. Um, I am going to put on a lipstick. I'm going to take it off after this video and then reapply it when I go out to Upper Canada Village with my family for the light show. But for like bumming it around the house, I'm just going to put on a lip gloss. But because this is what my makeup's going to look like later, I'm going to put this on for the purpose of the get ready with me. So this is just one of the mini Tarte lipsticks in Surf's Up. All right, and then finally, just to set my face, I'm just going to go back in with the NYX setting spray. Okay, so I can place this get ready with me. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, I'm definitely going to be filming more of these like chatty get ready with me's more this year so that I can like catch up with you guys and whatnot. Um, maybe I'll do like Q&A's in it. You know what I mean? Like I'll get you guys to ask me questions and then I'll answer them during these get ready with me's if I have nothing to update you guys on. But yeah, so expect new videos every Wednesday. I'm not going to have a specific time. Hopefully they'll be up in the morning, but just expect them on Wednesdays. That's when this one's going to go up. It'll be my first video of 2018 and I'm a lot happier. Like from what I can see them filming, the lighting's better than my last video. So I'm really happy I didn't upload it. So if you guys have any recommendations for videos for 2018, just leave them down below. I'll definitely check them out and read them. But yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, don't forget to smash that thumbs up and subscribe down below. That way you never miss my face in your subscription box. So yeah, thank you guys again so much for watching and I will see you next Wednesday. Bye. Tonight, hey, mom, we're gonna be alright. Dry those eyes, we'll be back.